On August 15, 1971, the United States flipped a switch that changed money forever. From that day on, every dollar became debt. For decades, the US dollar was tied to gold. Under the Bretton Woods system of 1944, one ounce of gold was fixed at $35, and countries around the world trusted the dollar because it could be converted into gold on demand. But by the late 1960s, the US was drowning in expenses from the Vietnam War and rising social programs. The government printed more dollars than it had gold to back. Nations noticed. France, under President Charles de Gaulle, began demanding gold instead of dollars. Other countries prepared to do the same. If they succeeded, America's gold reserves would vanish. So on August 15, 1971, President Richard Nixon went on national TV and made a historic announcement the US would suspend the dollar's convertibility to gold. The world watched as the gold window slammed shut. Overnight, the dollar became a fiat currency, money backed by nothing but government promises. Banks could now create money simply by issuing loans. Every new dollar entered the world as debt. What began as a temporary emergency measure became permanent. And today, the global financial system still runs on money that comes from thin air and debt that never truly disappears.